here we are, we've arrived Portable, my hometown, Tenby, over there. And we've walked through Penali up to the Gauta, Gauta Point here. This is Caldy Island over there. Hopefully this summer I'll be transmitting from Caldy Island. I've been seeing it for many, many years and I think this is going to be the year. So that's Caldy Island over there. And here's the antennas. We've got a wire gain master up on a Minnesota fiberglass. Got a bit of a bend in it here. Hopefully it won't snap. It's quite windy. Hopefully you can hear me. And uh, I've got a dipole sloping here. I've actually forgot my uh, antenna switch, so I need to disconnect to put the other antennas in. But uh, we'll give it a go anyway. Quite windy up here, I'm quite surprised. But uh, love the location. Uh, about a five minute drive from my house, it's not far to go, so. Uh, I've never brought a radio at this part before, so we'll see how it goes. I'm just using the uh, Yesu FD891. Post this up later on on YouTube and probably on TikTok. If you want to see the full episode, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you will uh, see it on my YouTube there. So that's the story there. 73 for now. Yeah, uh, you know, my first contact on 40 meters. I'm normally working today, but I took a few days off, so uh, and the wife has finished night shift, so she's away to sleep. So uh, <laughs> I thought I'll go out there, a bit of exercise and walking up the hill here. And they set up the portable here, but I was quite surprised how windy it is. I wasn't expecting it when I parked the car, it wasn't windy, but uh, obviously I'm a little bit higher up there. Uh, I'm looking over Tembe and I'm overlooking uh, Cold Island here at the moment there, so I don't know if we've done much uh, walking down this neck of the woods here, but uh, that's the story. I'm running with uh, Yesu 891 and uh, I've got a dipole there uh, set up there. Well, it's actually a multi band sort of dipole there, but it seems to be. The SWR's about 1.5, so I'm not whinging at that, it's working anyway there, but uh, you're absolutely stomping in here, Dave, curious help. Okay, go for Tango Charlie X ray, Mike Whiskey 6 Hotel, November, November, slash portable there. Well, thanks for the call, Dave. Have a good weekend, mate. Uh, it's not so sunny here, but it's, it's quite warm, just windy. Uh, but it's kind of cloudy as well there, but at least it's not going to rain. Well, I hope not anyway there. Right, pleasure working you, Dave. Have a good one, and uh, thanks for the report there up to Shropshire. Uh, go for Tango Charlie X ray, uh, Mike Whiskey 6 HRN, slash portable. Cheers, Dave, 73. Yeah, okay, there Thanks Dave, 73, uh, QRZ40, Mike Whiskey 6, Hotel, November, November, slash portable. Right, call for Mike Delta Bravo, uh, QRB, slash portable. Uh, excuse me, I'm, I'm trying to write all this down, it's windy here at the moment. Uh, name is Darren, name is Darren, you're about 5 and 7, 5 and 8. And uh, the location here, I'm, I'm, about, I'm about two miles from Tembe, the home QTH. I'm up on a, a cliff looking over uh, Penale, Tembe, and uh, uh, called the Island. Uh, I'm, I'm maybe about half a mile from called the Island at the moment, but I'm not that great a swimmer. <laughs> uh, but that's the location, the handle's Darren. Uh, Golf 4, Mike Delta, Bravo, slash QRP, Portable, Mike Whiskey 6, HRN, Portable, over.
Yeah, go for Mike Delta Bravo. Portable MW68 share and portable returning there, Bob Bevel. I'm not sure if I've watched it before or if not, I'm just doing a paper lock here. Uh, a lot of QSB on the last one there, and uh, some uh, a bit of static crashes going on there also there. Uh, we hear you quite well, mate. Uh, yeah, we're, we're uh, as I say, southwest coast of Wales. There, well, it's not so much high ground. I'm probably maybe a hundred feet above sea level because I can see the sea from here. Uh, I'm running with a Yesu FT891 and uh, a dipole there. I've, I've got it. Uh, <laughs> a kind of cowboy job, but it's uh, it's handling at the moment. I've got one of the little uh, fiberglass so so to be me. Uh, fiberglass telescopic mass there and I've just hammered a metal post into the ground there and a bit of coax there and uh, Bob's your uncle and uh, I'm on the airwaves there but uh, uh, Bob over. Yeah, well, how many watts have you got there um, Darren? How many watts got it? Yeah, 10 watts over. Yeah, QSL Bob, yeah, it's, it's, it's not cold here, it's just windy. Uh, as I was saying to Dave, I was speaking to the last uh, QSO there, I, I parked the car uh, down in uh, the Penale train station car park there, and uh, it was warm, you know, it was about 16, 17 Celsius, and uh, as soon as I started walking and uh, going up in a bit higher levels there, uh, my ears were like Dumbo, it started blowing about, I've, I've actually put my uh, Icom uh, baseball cap on that I don't really wear very often, I usually put it on in the, when I'm sitting in the shack so nobody sees me on it, Chai, but uh, I put it on there even though I'm using a Yesu there, but I like Icom, but I, I thought I put it on there, I'm, I'm going out portable, I'm going to even put the Icom com hat on there and uh, try and do it properly there, uh, Bob, over. Oh, well, we'll need, to, we'll need to swap packs then. <laughs> I've got an eye coming in the shack there. We'll need to swap packs here, Bob, over. standing post there, about 100 yards from here, and it's actually got two scaffold poles off, so they put flags and that on it, you know, and uh, there was a there's a padlock on the bottom of it, and then there's a big bolt at the top of it, you just take the bolt out and slide it over, so I thought, I'll give it a go there, and I took the bolt out and, and I brought the pole down, but it was rather heavy for one person, so I put it back up there, I didn't want to mess it around anymore, so I just uh, then I ended up just setting it all up here, you know, so it's all sorted, but if I ever come up here in company, I think I'll, uh, I'll use that as a master. I don't think they would mind, we're not doing anything, mind you know, but uh, you never know, but as long as we maybe get a never's worth of radio out, it'll be worthwhile now. Right, well, Bob, thanks so much, nice to work with you, uh, maybe for the first time, I'll, I'll log this later on when I get home, and uh, we'll keep giving a call there before this battery runs out. I'm using uh, a golf cart uh, battery there, which usually lasts in about four or five hours there, so it was fully charged there, but we'll see how it goes there. Right, it's been a pleasure, mate, enjoy your weekend there. And they hopefully we cross the tenors again there. Hopefully you're not hearing uh, too much uh, background noise coming from the wind here, because as I say, it's blowing the games here at the moment. Maybe I should have brought a jacket, it's getting colder as it goes on here. It's uh, been a pleasure, have a good one there, and uh, hopefully we'll catch you soon. Go for uh, Mike Delta Bravo uh, slash QRP Portable, Mike Whiskey 6, H&M Portable in uh, overcast Wales, but not cold, but windy. 73, I'll listen to a final there, Bob. Back to you, over. It's been a pleasure, Bob. Have a good one till next one seventy three. QRZ forty. Secure, secure. Mike Whiskey Six Hotel, November, November Portable. Mike Whiskey Six Hotel, November, November Portable. Listening. Secure, secure. Mike Whiskey Six Hotel, November, November Portable. Mike Whiskey Six Hotel, November, November Portable. Calling CQR by over. CQ, CQ, Mike Whiskey 6, Hotel, November, November, Portable.
Mike Whiskey 6 Hotel, November, November Portable. Mike Whiskey 6 Hotel, November, November Portable. Listening. CQ, CQ, Mike Whiskey 6 Hotel, November, November Portable. Mike Whiskey 6 Hotel, November, November Portable. Calling CQ and by over. Mike Zero, Mike Zero again, please. Mike Zero, Yankee, Zulu, Yankee, good afternoon. Uh, you're 59 plus plus here, name is Darren, uh, portable station in the southwest coast of Wales. I'm just uh, on some cliffs here, uh, looking over Tembe and uh, Cobb Island here. Uh, very strong here, over. Yeah, Roger, uh, just about copy you out the background noise. You're about five and seven. Five and seven to me, I understand you're in there. Uh, Yeah, QSL Steve, sounding good to you. Five and nine plus plus, a bit of QSB, but uh, hearing you reasonably well there. Yeah, we're just on uh, the cliff there, looking over the sea, both sides here, uh, looking over to call the island, and uh, over to the home QTH of uh, Tembe. Uh, running with Yesu FT891 and the uh, dipole there on a uh, fiberglass sota beam uh, telescopic mast there with a, a bit of metal hammered into the, the cliff edge here. So, uh, Rather uh, windy and breezy up here, but uh, it's quite warm, but uh, really windy. <laughs> uh, not a bit dull also there, it was sunny earlier on there, but it seems to have overcast here. But I'm just hoping that uh, uh, the, the WX-ray gods don't give us any rain at the moment there, or, or I'm in a bit of trouble there. Uh, I'll need to actually back up rather quick there, but uh, that's the story here. Uh, Mike Zero, Yankee, Zulu, Yankee, Mike Whiskey 6 Hotel, November, November, Portable, over. I'm using a, a, a dipole, a dipole at the moment there, and it's, it's actually in the in, inverted V configuration at the moment there. Uh, so as yeah, because uh, I was a bit unprepared. It was it was just by the off chance. I'm usually working at this uh, on a Friday, but I've got a few days off here. I'm not back in the job till uh, Tuesday, and the wife was finished the uh, night shift. So I thought there uh, she's away for a sleep. I thought uh, oh I'll just go up and uh, go out to portable there, something different, you know. So. Uh, it's just a dipole there, and uh, I've got one end of it pegged into the ground, and the other one uh, is a cable tied round to a, a small sledgehammer that I put the metal post into the ground here. So uh, that, that's the story here, but it's, uh, it's blown about something awful to tell you the truth. I was quite surprised at uh, how windy it is here. Uh, I've seen the other QSOs I had there. Uh, I got out of the car at the car park down at Penelope Tranali uh, train station there. And it's quite nice and calm, but as soon as I get near to the sea and uh, a bit higher up there, it's, it's blown, blown something off you. I'm quite surprised this, Steve, over. Yeah, Roger, it's, uh, it's often surprising, isn't it, uh, if you're on the coast. Um, as, soon as, um, as soon as you, you get uh, over up in the sea, uh, you get hit by the breeze. But um, nice space to operate from, and uh, hopefully you can um, utilise the, uh, uh, the salt water in the sea to um, get a bit of the... Uh, Yeah, it's sounding good, mate. Nice audio. Nice audio coming from your station there. Uh, I'm quite The noise level here is just amazing. So is there. Uh, I think I'm actually going to pack a suitcase and move up here just for radio. Because <laughs> uh, back home there on uh, 40 metres, I use a half wave head, head fed back home there. And uh, in the daytime, uh, well, I usually only notice it uh, the weekend in the daytime. I usually get about S4 or 5 of noise in the evening. It can be a bit higher at times here. 
Uh, but here at the moment now, I've got about maybe S1 of noise. It's just uh, the perfect radio location, I would say, Steve. Yeah. But uh, obviously, I, I live in a street with other, with other uh, houses there. Uh, and you know, we all the electric gadgets, etc., etc., that gives us some QR and answer there. So, uh, uh, and I know 40 metres can be a noisy band also, but the noise level, level here is just, just amazing. It's the quietest I've had it for quite some time. Well, the last time I was on 40 metres, I was using uh, an Ampro whip on the car from down Tenby Harbour, and I had a bit of noise down there, but obviously, there's more. Uh, more houses there nearby to Tenby Harbour, but there's, well, there's no houses here for a good, I would say a good two miles anyway, so it just shows to show if you can get a bit of land there out in the sticks or uh, next to the sea there with no houses right about you, it's, it's perfect for the receive, Steve, over. Yeah, very good. Um, yeah, I know what you mean. At the moment, um, I've got about S, S7 of noise here, so um, unless it's a strong signal, I've got no chance, but uh, you're right. Yeah, M0YZY, MW6HN Portable. Steve, thanks for the call, much appreciated there. Uh, here you with no problem about understanding your noise level there. 59 plus plus, absolutely stunning. Yeah, yeah, I can hear you fine. Thanks for the call, Steve. Thank you. 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 Thank you, 73 QRZ40, Mike, Whiskey 6 Hotel, November, November, Portable, listening. CQ, CQ, Mike, Whiskey 6 Hotel, November, November, Portable, calling CQ, over. Echo Zero again. Okay, two echo zero. Uh, excuse me, excuse me. I've just had a drink of iron brew, and I'm, I'm kind of rifting almost over the microphone. <laughs> uh, two echo zero. Uh, Golf Quebec Lima. Hopefully, I'll get the call correct. Uh, Mike Whiskey Six Hotel, November, November slash Portable. Uh, operator name here is Darren. Uh, I'm Portable in a cliff here, uh, just outside Tembe, looking over. I'm looking over Penale, Tembe, and uh, Caldy Island. I just wish uh, that I was on Caldy Island transmitting, but uh, not today, there. Uh, you're about 5, 7, 5 and 9 there. Uh, I did get a bit of QRM, someone's moved very close by to the frequency, it sounds like a bit of uh, European uh, uh, stuff here, uh, but it sounds it there. I think he's in between frequency there, but uh, not to worry there. But, uh, 5, 7, 5 and 9 there, 2, Echo, 0, uh, Golf, Queen, Lima, hopefully I have your call correct. Mike, Whiskey 6, HNN slash Portable, over. Yeah, I got the, the tail end there. I'm sorry, this station gave me a bit of QRM there. Uh, I don't know if I'm giving him QRM, but I was on this frequency for some time there. I'm sorry, I didn't get the name. I got the TSA 50, nice radio. I've had a few names over the years there. Sounding really good there. And the antenna, I'm using that FT891 uh, with a dipole there. Uh, sloping configuration at the moment, both sides there. Uh, it's the best I can set up. A bit of a cowboy job, but we've managed to get on the airwaves here. Sorry, what was your name? Sorry, over. Yeah, name is Rob. Romeo. 
secure cell rob where you can right over the noise there. Uh, not so much the noise, just the QRM there. Uh, there's a station very close by to this frequency, I think it's maybe about a couple of hertz down here. Uh, but he's giving me a bit of QRM there when, when you're last over there. Uh, I don't know if you're picking, are you picking out any background noise like as in high wind over? Yeah, are you picking out any any background noise as in high wind there, Rob QSL? Yeah, he's fading a little bit there. You're coming over, over him now there. Uh, I think he's on maybe... I think he's on 8350 eight, 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 uh, eight, 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 uh, 8250 maybe. But he's uh, very close there. I'm sure if I could hear him, he could hear me there. Uh, just some stations decide not to bother, they don't care. But uh, there we go, what can you do? You can't do much about it, can you? <laughs> uh, but sounding good, you're 850, sounding good. Uh, what were you using? A halfway of Enfield, did you say, Rob? Oh, fantastic! That's what I'm using at the moment as well. With a soda, uh, soda bean pole, and then I've put a little uh, metal pole. I brought a wee small sledgehammer up here in the rucksack and hammered it in, and then I've just uh, cable tied it and uh, put some other clamps on it and everything. And it seems to be working okay. It's been through the wars, really. To tell you the truth, I don't think it's got much more uh, life in it. To tell you the truth, it's bending the hell here at the moment. Now you think you had a big salmon on it, but it's holding up for now. Yeah, but I'm quite surprised how windy it is here. <laughs> Any other time I've come up here, well I've never come up here with the radio, but any time I've come up here walking, it's been nice and calm, but I, unfortunately I picked the day there. I'm normally working there, but I, I've got a few days off here, so uh, and the wife is uh, sleeping due to finishing night shift, and I thought, oh I'm going to go out portable, I'm not sitting about in the shack, I'd rather get out and get some fresh air, and uh, burn some calories after having a KFC, so I, I thought that was a good idea there, Rob, to yourself. Yeah, two echo zero golf queen Lima Mike Whiskey Six H and then slash portable there. Thanks for the call, Rob. Much appreciated. Have a fantastic weekend and uh, hopefully we'll cross the tenors again in the near future. I'm gonna clear this frequency and uh, find a better one there uh, without any QRM, but I hope so anyway. Thanks Rob, 73 MW6 H and then portable clear from this frequency. 73 Rob, thanks. Zero, Sarah, Tango, Tango, good afternoon, thanks for the call, Mike Whiskey 6 Hotel, November, November, Portable, I'll put your name here, Darren, Delta, Alpha, Romeo, Romeo, Echo, November, you're about 5 and 5, 5 and 5 with some QSB, and I'm Portable, just looking over the sea here, uh, on a cliff here, uh, near to Tembe, and looking over to Caldy Island here at the moment there. Uh, 2 Echo Zero, uh, Sierra Tango Tango, Mike Whiskey 6, HRN slash Portable, how copy over? Nice to work here. I'm not sure if I worked before. I'm just doing a paper log here. Well, I'm trying to do a paper log. It's blowing a gale here at the moment. <laughs> yeah, I'm quite surprised how windy it is there. Yeah, I'm trying to shelter here, but there's no much shelter to tell you truth of where I am. I'm just looking over to Cold Island there. And uh, I'm in the highest bit here, really, on this cliff. So uh, 
maybe a bit silly. I should have just went down a bit of the graded a little bit there, but uh, I thought the uh, height is might, so I thought I'd get up the highest bit there, set up the antenna and uh, go for it. <laughs> uh, but it is what it is there, Tony. No rain at the moment, thankfully. I hope it doesn't, or I'll, uh, I'll need to go like uh, start too much to pack up the equipment here. Uh, running a Yesu FT891, uh, and I'm using a dipole antenna, uh, sloping configuration at the moment. Yeah, that's the best I can do. A bit of a cowboy job, but got myself one of the airwaves there. Uh, normally in work there, but I uh, got a few days off, so I thought I'll go out port go while the, the station manager, aka the wife, is uh, sleeping after a night shift. Yeah, so that's the story here, uh, Tony. Two Echo Zero, uh, Sierra Tango Tango, QRP, MW6, H&M, portable, over. Yeah, I'm, I'm originally from Glasgow, uh, born in Glasgow, but I left Glasgow when I was about 10 or 11 there. Uh, parents moved down to the west coast of Scotland there, but uh, then I emigrated back to Glasgow when I was about 18. Uh, but I've been down here in the uh, Tembe, southwest coast of Wales, uh, 20, just over 24 years now. I'm almost a local, Tony, over. Uh, I kind of thought you might have been a wee <laughs> Thanks very much for the kind words here. <laughs> Yeah, fantastic. Yeah, I, I do miss Scotland, of course. I got whenever I got a chance to go up there. I haven't been up for about three years, mind you, there. But uh, gradually through the years, I haven't been up as much as I, I did when we first moved down here. Uh, Tembe's home now. It's a, a fantastic place. I don't know if you know, know where Tembe is there, but uh, it's a wee seaside town and it's just, just a beautiful place. Yeah, a great place for radio for sure there, Tony. Over. I won't get any religion over the airways there, but I'm a Ranger supporter. Uh, yeah, that's what I say by Rangers. <laughs> it's a bit silly, really, when they. Uh, so it's crazy. Great situation there with all that there, mate, you know what I mean? But I won't get that uh, over the airwaves there. But yeah, <laughs> noted there, my, my uncle. Uh, was in a, 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 a sort of group thing there back in the day there. He's, he's, he's sadly passed away now there and uh, his wife was uh, from the other side there and they had to tell a little bit of a white lie uh, to keep it kind of secretive that he was marrying the other half there, if you know what I mean of it. Ok Tony, thanks for the call, have a great weekend there, yeah. and a uh, nice work here, yeah. 2 Echo Zero, Sierra Tango Tango, uh, QRP, Mike Whiskey 6, H&M Portable, 73, cheers Tony, all the best. Alright, all the best to you and God bless you Darren. Thank you, good luck, QRZ40, Mike Whiskey 6, Hotel, November, November, slash Portable, listening.